Salesforce Quick Tips with Maddie G. As a Salesforce administrator, you're eventually going to get asked to only show a field or a button on your page layouts under certain circumstances. So in this quick tip, I'm going to show you how you can do that really quick and easy with dynamic forms and dynamic actions. So right now I'm on an account layout and I want to say only render the phone field if the rating for an account is hot. Um, so let's figure out how to do that. The first thing I'm going to do is go up here to the start uh, setup menu and click edit page. And that will take us to the lightning record page for this account. And now I'm going to have to do some weird things with the screen because of how irritating Salesforce is rendering this. So right here we have our record detail. And if I click on this over here on the right side, you'll see that there is an Upgrade Now button. What we'll want to do is click this Upgrade Now button to turn it from a regular record detail into dynamic forms, which will allow us to dynamically render fields whenever you know we feel like it. Um, if you wanted to do this for buttons, you would click this, uh, the Highlights panel up here. And I've already done this, but there will be a button up here that says, um, you know, turn on dynamic actions. And then you'll be able to click on each button over here and create what's called a visibility filter, which we're going to do in just a second. So <clears throat> we want to only show this phone field when the rating is hot. So what I'm gonna do is underneath this set field visibility, I'm gonna click add filter. And then I'm going to change this from account currency to rating, oh, if I can spell, and I'm going to set it equal to, which it's already done, hot. And we'll hit done. And we'll click save up here. And now once this is saved, what we're going to do is go back to our account page, which I'm going to do by clicking this button over here. And what we'll see is there is no phone field anymore underneath co co uh, the cold rating. <laughs> but if we switch this, to hot and save the record, the phone field all of a sudden shows up, which I have filled which, with a bunch of gibberish, but hopefully you've got a phone number in there. So now you know how to dynamically render fields or buttons on a page layout. Hopefully this lightning quick tip or Salesforce quick tip was helpful to you. And hopefully I'll see you next time on